This is sponsored by the leader for the creation of our state police. Mr. Speaker, honorable members, Marines are already alluded to in the course of his argument. That is the issue of funding. Mr. Speaker, honorable members, we are all living witnesses to the fact that state governments today, as they are presently, presently constituted, find it extremely difficult to pay salary of civil servants, talk less of getting additional burden of funding state police. And by the time we create state police, these are people that are going to be trained in the use of firearms, and then firearms will be entrusted to their care for use. And if eventually, for whatever reason, the state could not be able to pay their salaries, then all of us could imagine the consequences of what is going to happen. So on that note, Mr. Speaker, honorable members, I don't support the creation of state police. I will only support the creation of state police on one proviso, and that is to the fact that there is a need for a constitutional amendment for devolution of powers so that more resources will be released from the federal to the state by way of altering the present revenue allocation formula so that states will get more percentage compared to what it is now before they can take the burden of funding state police. So there is the need for us to alter the revenue allocation formula if we are going to certain states with the burden of having a state police. Thank you. Empty.